welcome back guys to another video here from Copangan. Unfortunately, we didn't have a lot of time here to film videos as Laura got sick. So now we are going to Kotao, where we will hopefully be able to explore the island a little bit more. It is supposed to be the best island for diving and snorkeling, so very excited to see that. Let's go and follow us along on our catamaran journey to Kotao. This is our non-refundable ticket to Kotao. We paid 450 per person, so 900 in total. And now we are going onto the catamaran. I didn't expect there to be so, so many people. Like there are so many foreigners going to Kotao today. This ship is gonna be full. Lara, isn't it crazy that people built something to cross the seas? I think it's even more crazy yeah, that people build something that flies. Every time it blows my mind, like crossing the sea with a boat or flying in an airplane through the air, it's, it's crazy. It's so shaky, oh my god. Back to land. I'm not seasick anymore. So Laura, how did you like the ship? Wow, that was really shaky, really bumpy. But, but it was fine. Yeah, it, it was, was like bad. It was okay. I think we are getting picked up here somewhere, so let's try to find our taxi. Yeah, I think uh, that's a pretty standard thing here in Thailand on the island that people will pick you up or your hotel will pick you up so you don't have to book like a taxi. So let's see how this goes. So happy to see so much tourism. I remember back in uh, Indonesia, we've been like the only tourists. Craziness! This is a touristy island. <laughs> Kopangan was totally different, and supposedly Kotao was much smaller now, yeah. Yeah. Two. We two. Yeah. Okay, we found our guy. Huh? <laughs> it's really remote, yeah. Oh, big room. Very big room. Wow. I have to admit, it's a little bit remote, but I like it a lot. Our hotel is really nice. The room looks really, really good. It's very big. We are super excited to get some rest here because the last days were so extremely exhausting. So now we are ready to do some vacation and we are also ready to see a beautiful Thailand island. So let's roll the Lima Vlogs room to intro. Welcome to my crib. This is, you could even say my apartment. Like this is a huge, huge room. We have a desk here with a freezer or a fridge. But we can even make some food here, that is nice. This is the bathroom, pretty simple, there's the shower, this is the toilet, that's it. Here we have another desk with two chairs, which is really really nice for us because we can actually sit and work. Then we have another chair, another small desk and we have a TV where we can watch a movie at night, that is also very nice and we have a huge very comfortable looking bed, which I am very excited to get some rest soon. <laughs> and then we come to my personal highlight of this apartment, our balcony. Let's check out our very first beach of Koh Tao. So we are very excited to see our very first beach after all the time we spent sick. Or well, Lara spent sick on Koh Phangan and now we feel a little better. A lot better actually and we are ready to see our very first beach. Maybe we go snorkeling, maybe not. Depends on how many tourists are there. I see the very first snorkelers over there. This beach is really really beautiful and I see not so many people here. Snorkeling will be so much fun. Yeah, I think so. So excited to hop in. Wow, look at this crystal clear water. Wow. Bye, Lara. Oh boy. How was it? 
That was really awesome. Like I would even say that it's the most beautiful underwater world that I have ever seen. It's so, so perfect. If you are in Thailand, definitely come here. This is the best underwater world that I have ever seen. Honestly, this beach looks a little bit like paradise. We have this blue, crystal blue water. We have all these people here chilling at the stone, sleeping. We have all this incredible nature of these giant rocks. It's really beautiful and also all this housing on the left side there, wow. But now we will hop to the next beach because Lewa wants to check out one more spot. I kind of feel scammed if I have to pay for public places like beaches. So we are now at Freedom Beach. You have to pay 50 baht per person for the entrance. And yeah, let's see whether that is worth it. Wow, it's very quiet here and I see people are just sitting in the water, taking a dip and relaxing. This beach is all about relaxing, maybe less about snorkeling. Alright guys, we gotta admit, we spent the whole time here at the beach just sitting at these chairs and not filming and doing anything. We didn't even go into the water. It's really relaxing with the music in the background. It's very beautiful. You can see here the people bathing and everybody's super relaxed. We want to say thank you guys for following us along today with the snorkeling experience which was really fun. We had a long journey from Copagan with the ship here to Kotao. We love it actually. It's pretty nature. It's it's incredible. We hope this inspires you to go to Kotao as well. And guys, we're gonna see you in the next episode. Bye bye. This beach really looks like stuff. Oh, okay. This beach. What's the next one? Yeah, it's that beach. Let's follow up. <laughs> um, this bus, this, because the last day were Oops. this is our Basai Balcony. Balcony.